I do not think the United States should undermine their sovereignty in any way. The establishment of Israel came about with a movement called uh, Zionism, and Zionism had two basic principles. One was independence and self-reliance, and I agree with those two basic uh, uh, fundamental premises of Zionism. But I also don't think we should tell them what to do. If they want to have a peace treaty with some neighbor and think they can work it out, they shouldn't have to ask us for permission. They shouldn't have to ask us permission to defend their borders. That should be their business. But also, I do not believe that I should take money from anybody here and send money to Israel. And some people would say, oh, that means you're anti-Israel. But I'm pro-American. <laughs> but, but no, actually, this is a benefit to Israel. First, when you give money, that implies we own you. And second is if you cut out all foreign aid, Israel comes out ahead because their neighbors get about five times as much assistance, you know, than Israel gets. So uh, I don't think I don't think it's much of a problem. But we should be friends. We should trade with them. Uh, I would encourage them to become the Hong Kong of the Middle East or something like that. You know, have a really uh, affluent society. But we have. Uh, we, uh, we have every reason to want to get along, and, and we can, uh, but uh, to, to control them and regulate and, and hold them back, I think that is not necessary. 